Hello, this is another in the series of the MS0P videos. The difference this time is that I'm going to show you a function that hasn't yet been released. It's a prototype of something that I think may be useful. Please let me have your feedback. We'll start by selecting two queue managers in the navigator tree on the left hand side of the Explorer. Creating the queue manager links brings up a wizard that will do all of the work for us on connecting these and defining the channels. The default options are probably all you need, uh, although you can change them if you want. When you go through the wizard, the second page shows the actual commands that are going to be issued. If you want, you can take copies of these, put them in scripts and reuse them later. Completion of the wizards will execute the commands on both of those queue managers. In this case, creating queues as well that we can use for testing and starting the channels. The queues that have been created are two on each side, one remote queue definition and one local queue. I'm going to use the remote queue definition to put a message from one queue manager to the other. You see that put, and if I go to the corresponding local queue on the other queue manager, browsing the messages on there, we'll see that the message has turned up. So with just a simple click to connect those two queue managers, we've defined all of the resources that we need to work with them in future. Something simple, something quick, part of the purpose of MS0P. <laughs>